Okay. I'm not getting very much power now, but uh, those power panels are uh, Kyocera KC120. Uh, there's four of them, and uh, so they'll produce uh, 480 watts at peak power, which is almost half a kilowatt. And I'll show you the batteries. Here's a close up, what they look like. There's a power cable there. All right. Now to the battery bank. Six Charette S460 six volt batteries, which gives me 1380 amp hours, and uh, they weigh 117 pounds each. They're, They're pretty heavy. Guaranteed for 10 years. So fairly reliable, but still the weakest part of my system. Now we'll move on to the inside. Everything goes through the charge controller, which regulates the electricity to the batteries from the solar panels and also feeds it out into the system. And then I have a 2500 watt inverter to change my 12 volt DC into AC. And I also have a little 300 watt inverter that's a pure sine inverter because these big inverters, a lot of them don't make very clean power and some equipment doesn't like it. Like Craftsman chargers. <laughs> yes, like Craftsman chargers which blow up immediately. Now there's a secret weapon in this system, and that's hidden down here. And those little square things you can see all geared together there, together they make up a supercapacitor that has a thousand farads at 15 volts, which is basically 15 kilowatts of power available at instantaneous notice. That's why he can run things like a microwave. And have a pump for running water. Or run a fridge. It's a mini bar fridge, but it's still a fridge. Also, you want to show your hot water, don't you? What? So, oh, yeah, put your hot water. Yeah, the hot water system. Currently, uh, is heated from the stove. No, not by beer. <laughs> no, we are powered by beer. Oh, oh it's have a fire. Well, we can't see too much in there, but there's a water jacket that goes down the side of it. And that comes back, up back here. Pump here. Pipes here, and it's just driven with hydrostatic pressure, and the heats up tank. the water, and uh, away you go. The whole system is pressurized, so it runs fine. And like I said, running water. But when power runs short, we do have a battery. We have running water. It's a little bit dirty when it's been sitting around for a while. <laughs> so that's the solar system and the hot water.